He likes it. I think it was a couple of years after we had uh, completed Mary Poppins that uh, Cubby Broccoli came to me with this idea. He had read the original Ian Fleming book, Chitty Chitty Bang Bang, which I had never read to his children. And I remember at the time, I was such a, a Walt Disney fan. I was convinced that the only person who knew how to do children's entertainment was Walt Disney. But then, of course, he got uh, Dick and uh, Bob Sherman. And once I heard the music, the, I knew that the, they really had something. It was shortly after that that uh, I said I'd do it. Caractus Potts was uh, kind of a rebel, kind of a, a guy who th thought outside the box. And I, I loved that character. He went his own way, educated his own kids, and just lived his own life the way he saw it fit. He was a crackpot. <laughs> Stand back. Keep clear. <laughs> does he know what he's doing? Of course he does. Whoa! <laughs> I've always had a habit of improvising the physical part of it. It's just an instinctive with me. If I see an opportunity in a scene to put something physical in, I'll just put it in. So a lot of those things happen right on the set at the moment. Oh. Thank you. That just seemed to fit that character. He was a little absent-minded professor type and a little bit of a klutz. <laughs> Would it be too much to ask what this is, this um, thing? Little invention of mine cleans carpets by suction. Oh, that's to clean carpets? <laughs> we had to have a little edge there between the two of them. They couldn't just fall in love at first sight. Oh, I do. Oh, well, and what's this gadget? Well, that's not quite right yet, but eventually I hope to transmit moving pictures by wireless. <laughs> really? Yes, really. And I kind of liked uh, his getting really sensitive about her, her making fun of his inventions because they were his pride and joy, those inventions. I think that the problem is... The boiling point of your sugar is too high. She made fun of him, so he, he had a right to get crotchety. Well, I've never Spoke been... Spoke to do that way before? Well, maybe it's about time. Oh. Good afternoon, madam. Find the cable. 